What's going on, guys? Welcome back to the Journey Podcast. Today, I have a tip for when you're prospecting clients. Um, if you're a fitness coach and you've ever been in the DMs with some clients and you have potential people who are saying that they're doing the right thing, but you in the back of your mind, you're just like, God, no, that's just not correct, right? Maybe they say, hey, you know, I'm good. You know, I cut my calories down to 1200. I've been doing a ton of cardio, going on runs, working out multiple times a day, taking zero rest days. And in the back of your mind, you're like, dude, that's just incorrect. But have you ever wondered how to actually correct them without being an a-hole, right? Because one thing that you don't want to do is when you are building trust and building relationship with your potential clients, you do not want to be oppositional. You don't want to be adversary. And what that means is that you don't want to come off as the enemy. You don't want to get on the wrong side of the table with that person. And so how can you tell somebody that they're wrong while also building trust and remaining their friend, right? Because another thing too, in the world of sales is that you never want your customer, you never want your potential client to feel dumb, right? And if you tell your client that they're wrong, they're going to feel dumb. And then they're going to think of you negatively because you are the a-hole that incorrect or incorrected them in a way that made them feel dumb and inferior. And they're not going to like you, right? That's just kind of like human nature. So I had a client who pretty much came to me with this exact same situation. She was on a coaching call this week and she was like, Hey, you know, I I'm in the DMS with these girls and you know, how do I tell them that they're doing things totally wrong and without, you know, being an a-hole without, you know, um, just essentially just telling them that they're doing things wrong. I said, there's a really good way to do this. You want to actually agree with them and offer a better solution. So if someone says, Hey, I'm doing 1200 calorie diets, I'm doing a ton of cardio and I am, you know, just restricting myself. You don't want to just be like, Hey, you know, that's actually incorrect. You shouldn't be doing that because they're going to think, Oh, well, you know, am I wrong? Like they're just going to think negatively about the situation. Instead, what you want to do is you want to agree with them and then offer a better solution. Right. And so what the way you can agree with it is you can be like, Hey, I actually used to do that too. Right. I used to think I used to do that too. I used to do that same exact thing. Right. So whatever solution that they think is correct for them, agree with them by saying, Hey, I used to do that same thing too. Right. Cause now they feel heard and understood. They're like, Oh, I'm not alone. Like, Oh, you, you know, exactly what I'm experiencing. And we are on the same side now. Then what you're going to do is offer a better solution. So you're not saying one is right or wrong, but one is better, right? So I say, hey, I actually, I actually used to do that too. But you know, I actually got stuck. And it took me a really long time to see results. I actually found a better solution that was more sustainable, helped me get results faster. And I'm actually much healthier now. Would you like to hear about it? Right. And of course, they're going to be like, oh, of course, like that sounds awesome. A better solution that's working faster and more sustainable than what I'm doing now. And so now you're essentially introducing your methods as a solution that's better than the previous message with method without you being an a hole. So that's kind of how you want to do that tip. So if you're in the DMs and someone's saying something that's complete nonsense and you want to disagree with them, instead, agree with them first and foremost and then offer a better solution. Hey, you know, I used to do the same thing too. I remember when I used to, you know, do three workouts a day and I thought I was getting stronger, but you know, it turns out there's a better solution. I learned that when you give yourself more rest, you actually recover faster. I'd love to tell you a little bit more about it and see, you know, how it can help you. Right. And so that is how you are going to be able to tell people that they're wrong in the DMs and correct them without being an a-hole. So I hope that tip uh, resonated with you guys. We'll catch you guys in the next episode. Peace.